Welcome back, or welcome if you are new. Today we have a special polish. This is L'Oreal's Rhythm in Blue, and it is a beautiful shimmery blue polish. It is a super duper old polish, and I was having some trouble getting it to stretch over my nails in the first coat, but on the second coat it looked gorgeous. This is a hand-me-down, so I'm imagining that it was made in the early 2000s or even the 90s. I've never really seen polish from the 90s specifically, so I just have to guess. But yeah, I think it's really cool and I think it shows its age on the bottle. So I wanted to swatch it for you guys because I do have a lot of old hand-me-down polishes. Um, the brush was really cool. Um, the bottle was half empty, so that could be leading to the trouble I was having spreading it on my nails. But other than that, the formula was pretty good considering it hasn't been used in such a long, long time. And once again, it is a super duper gorgeous polish. I could find like absolutely nothing on this color. L'Oreal doesn't even make polishes anymore, I don't think. Here's me going into the second coat, and here's where you finally start to see the polishes true beauty come through. But yeah, I was searching and searching, I couldn't find anything on this color, which is surprising. I was kind of expecting it to be like some sort of like secret, super hyped up retro polish or something. I know that's goofy, but it just looks like it from the color. But yeah, let me know if you guys have any L'Oreal polishes. I don't own a whole lot. Um, L'Oreal and Maybelline, I think it's funny when I find polishes from them because I don't really see them anywhere. But this is such a beautiful polish on two coats, and I'm not a deep blue wearer or a shimmer polish wearer, but it was just so pretty, I just couldn't stop looking at it. This was in my d pile, but to be honest, this just looks so, like, classic. I just want to hang on to it because it's such a pretty old polish. I did suffer from a nail break recently. It hasn't broken off yet, but my pointer finger does have a pretty bad tear in it. I am anticipating it breaking off in about a week once it grows past the nail bed, unfortunately. I'm going to do everything I can to save it, but if that does happen, I will probably hold off on the nail polish of the week videos, just because I want to do them on, you know, like, even nails. Not that I would dislike doing them on, um, uneven nails, but for swatch pictures sake, I, would, I feel like I would feel like I'd have to redo them. So yeah, there might be a delay in nail polish of the week videos, which sucks because I love doing them so much. But I hope you all understand. I might try to put a thin layer of poly gel on them, maybe, and try to continue on with that till it's time to just cut it off. But anyways, here are the swatches. Thank you all so much for watching, and bye!